Hey guys, <clears throat> so I've uh, remounted the uh, the one meter tuned loop outside. I've uh, <clears throat> just for fun I've oriented it uh, at right angles to the way it was facing before, uh, and so I'll just run across the shortwave dial, uh, and you can hear um, how well it's doing. So it's right up at the 49 meter, uh, even beyond 50 meter. Du pouvoir politique, économique, social et culturel commençant à se déplacer de Séoul vers les communautés locales. Actually, I just noticed on the dial on the shortwave band here. It has thick lines against different bands, and they're usually the ones where you pick up stations. I hadn't noticed that before. Trebuie să explice despre ce este vorba. Aici este semnificativ, însă remarca lui Mihail Bogdanov și anume că a spus acesta dacă măsurile restrictive sau interdicțiile se aplică numai pentru că așa cer americanii, L'agenda des Balkans. You gotta admit, this is pretty crazy quality reception for shortwave. Yeah. 
terör örgütünün siyasi uzantılarını yönettiği belediyelerin yaptığı asfaltlarda bunlar çıkarsa misyona ministre roman externe Bogdan prezentato prima edizia forumului de la Salzburg viziunea României cu privire la existența între dreptul la autodeterminare și principiul integrității teritoriale explicând modul în care acestea sunt configurate And these strong stations come in, and the magic eye is fully closed. So. so EU retailers are now paying much less than they previously did for dairy and meat products. They have not passed on that price reduction to consumers, many of whom are already struggling because of the ongoing economic crisis in the bloc. The EU produces 150 million tons of milk each year from a herd of 87 million cows. But since there is no longer a Russian market, much of the produce is wasted. Some EU legislators say that the sanctions imposed on Russia have backfired, and they were put in place originally under the direction of the US, so as to boost business in that country. For Europe, it's a catastrophe. It's a real catastrophe. So I understand very well that US wants sanction. Looks like that's it. Still, that is pretty damn good. So, I'm happy with my Wellbrook antenna, that's for sure. And now I have it pointed in a better direction. <laughs> it's even better. Alright guys, that's it. Um, I am dead happy with that, especially on shortwave and also on broadcast. Um, and so yes, I'll. Uh, it's night time now, so I'll take a shot of the old antenna in action uh, tomorrow. Uh, and then we'll call this project a wrap.